as this season gets closer it's about to start i got one point guard that i'm really watching this year and that's that number 12 out in memphis my eyes are on ja moran you know two years ago he got in some trouble he was wilding out a little bit last year he comes back playing well but gets injured early out for the rest of the season so now coming in i want to know how do the fans treat him and how does the league as a whole treat him especially after you start to give yourself either a label of a distraction or kind of a head case like you're just a problem off the court the nba does not condone that especially with their superstars so my question is is this the last year is this the last chance for ja to get back in that conversation of best point guard in the league and also face of the league and best american player in the league austin rivers just came out and named the top five point guards in the nba and guess whose name was not included on that list he said it's luca shea jalen brunson steph and tyrese halliburton now this was a year ago two years ago especially before any of the incidents it would be almost blasphemous to not have john morant's name on that list i think john morant right now is very important to the league especially when you think about who the best players in the nba are top five players in the league for the first time ever none of them are american you got luca shea and b Giannis, Jokic. as far as americans though we got tatum we got Ant, and we got ja as far as young players who can take over so is there a way for ja to get back into the good graces of the nba as far as his image goes so that they can push him back into that conversation or is he at a point now where they're gonna do him like Melo or iverson gilbert you know where they say you're an extreme talent but you're not good for business and the second that your talent starts to slip we're not gonna really treat you with the respect that you deserve and we're gonna just kind of make sure you gradually get your way out the league until one day somebody looks up and says wait john moran what team is john on and he's not in the league anymore is that the path he's headed down or is he gonna save himself this year play great play amazing and then ascend all the way back to the player that he has the talent to be that's the scary thing about ja is like how much people love him very much like iverson so many kids love him i remember there was a time especially last year i almost didn't want nephews or players that i'm training i didn't want them to even be fans of john morant because of the influence that he has is he gonna be no strip clubs no weapons no drugs or is he somebody now that we have to hey listen yes he's good but don't try to be like him he's not your savior he's not your role model all right so i'm excited this year i just want to see what version of john morant we get and what the reception of him is i think that it's not too late and this year if he plays great and stays out of trouble he's right back into that best player in the nba face of the league conversation